what required the strength of machines. My mind was blind, so I tried to go help her. Was accomplished by a man yesterday as adrenaline and terror raced through Gino Jacobs' body. Everything was on top of her, you know, everything. You cannot see her. Gino remembers seeing the young woman walking down the sidewalk as he left the Common Ground restaurant. Everything passed so fast. And just as he crossed the street to his car. I feel like a breezy, something like a air behind me, and I feel like all smoke come out. And uh, when I turn around, and uh, I see everybody screaming, and uh, it was a lady on the ground. Gino had escaped serious injury himself and sprinted back across the street to do what he could, which meant lifting the heavy concrete blocks that had fallen. I was taking all the rocks out, and uh, finally we saw her because she was on, on the, everything on the knee. So we took her back, pulled her out. She was unconscious, he says, as they waited for first responders. 24 hours have passed, but Gino is still haunted by what he saw. I feel bad really hurts. Um, I see that, I remember, and I feel so bad really for her. He wished he could have done more. Now, Inspectional Services says they believe that high winds actually contributed to that old concrete facade coming down. We have tried, but we've been unable to confirm what that young woman's condition is tonight. 11 Alston, Julie Lonchek, WCVB News Center 5.